God wants to use you as a prophet. You understand? But you must be careful of spirit of pride. Amen. Huh? I hear you. Man. You hear what I'm saying? Yes. So what you can do, you be yourself. Amen. You understand? Yes. Uh, I think the guidance of today of studying the word faith is important for you. Amen. You understand? I hear you. Man. So God wants to use you. Because in the beginning, you were desiring to see visions. It's true. But nothing was happening. It's true. And then from there, you began to follow the service of God. It's true. But still nothing happened. Nothing happened. It's true. But can I tell you this? Because God doesn't want you to be like anybody. Yeah. He wants you to be like yourself. He's anointing you today, and he will start to use you. And nobody believed this man. My name is Pastor Emmanuel Nessi from Pumalanga in Whitbank. Uh, uh, when I came here today, I uh, wasn't expecting actually to be prophesied. The only thing that I came for was to come for deliverance. But then uh, God uh, went ahead of me and uh, he gave me a word of prophecy. Uh, and I confirm it to be true what the man of God said. I desired mo more of the gift of prophecy. Uh, and everything that you said, that our visions and everything were not there anymore uh, because of the journey and the, the things that happened in, in my journey with, with God. Yeah. And when the man of God told you what exactly you have never shared with anybody but God, how did you feel? Uh, to me, it, it made me to actually to, 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 to be excited uh, to know that God actually listens to our inner deep and deepest prayers because it was not something that I normally share with anyone. It was within me. I kept it quiet until today it was exposed to show that God sees and he hears. What are the words of encouragement that you can give to other people out there who are desiring deeper things of the spirit, but they don't know how to get them or they don't know whether God hears them? As today, God has answered your prayer. What are the words of encouragement that you can give to the servants of God out there? Uh, believe in what God has said to you. Uh, as we were told today that uh, have faith, have faith in him, not uh, relying on what other people might say or in the things that other people might say. But I would say that trust in what you believe that God will do for you and you will definitely succeed and God will make it come to pass.